Hey, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I wanted to reintroduce myself because there are so many new faces around here these days. I am Kaylee. I am a certified yoga and bar instructor and studying personal training. So fitness is something that I am super passionate about. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, go and follow me at kaylee.daniels because I'm always asking for suggestions, classes that you guys wanna see and everything like that. So follow me there. Today we're gonna do a 60 minute yoga sculpt class, your favorite and most requested class. We're gonna use a pair of light and heavy dumbbells. So I prefer three and five for my own practice. So grab what you have around the house or what you prefer and a yoga block. And the block isn't necessary, but it will be helpful for squeezing in between our thighs and a little bit of stabilization. But if you don't have it, a sturdy pillow will work great for both of those. So when you have all of that, I will meet you on the mat. Let's do this. Grab one of your heavier weights, slide it back about six inches behind the top of the mat on the right side, we'll use that. For the second song, feet step, hips with distance. Bend the knees a lot here as you fold over your legs into a rag doll. Hands meet the floor or you hold opposite elbows. A few moments here, swinging side to side. Letting the torso hang down towards the floor. Maybe shake the head. Soften the eyes, soften the jaw. And then coming to a still place, heel toe your feet together so that your big toes are touching. Push down into your right foot, step your left foot back. Keep your knee lifted, gaze forward as you reach the right arm forward, and then open up towards the right, find a twist. Left hand is planted. Right finger is reaching towards the sky. Take a big breath in. Twist a little bit deeper on your breath out. Keep this twist, left knee comes down. Use your inhale, lift up into an open twist. Breathe in, lengthen. Breathe out as you melt your right hand down to the back of your left thigh. Reach your left arm by your ear. So you're opening over towards the right. Feeling this into the whole left side body. Take a big breath in. And a big breath out. Slowly release, cartwheel both hands down, frame the foot. Gaze forward, breathe in. Press the hips back, straighten right leg as you breathe out. One more like that, inhale forward, plant the right foot, gaze forward. Exhale, push back. This time stay, walk the hands back. Find a halfway lift in the spine and exhale, fold a little bit deeper over your right leg. One full round of breath here, where can you soften? Beautiful, next inhale, start to walk forward. Plant your right foot, plant your hands, step forward into that forward fold. Halfway lift, and a deep fold. This time push into your left foot, step your right foot back. Keep the knee lifted, right hand stays planted. Gaze forward, reach, left arm forward. And then open it out towards the left. Right hand is rooted, left finger is reaching towards the sky, right knee is lifted, big breath in and a twisting exhale, beautiful. Keep this twist, right knee comes down. Next inhale, open twist over towards the left, right arm forward, left arm back. Breathe in, lengthen. On your exhale, melt your left hand down to the back of your right thigh. Reach your right arm by your ear. Breathe in as you lengthen your right side body. And breathe out to soften a little bit more. Beautiful, it feels so good. From here, we're gonna cartwheel both hands down, frame the front foot, gaze forward as you breathe in. Press your hips back as you breathe out. 
flex the toes. One more like that, inhale forward. And exhale, push back. This time walk the hands back with you. Underneath the shoulders, inhale, halfway lift. And then exhale, deep fold, half splits. Hips stay square towards the front of the mat. The crown of the head is reaching forward. Beautiful, and your next inhale, begin to walk it forward. Plant the hands this time, step back to a down dog. On your next inhale, lift your heels. On your exhale, melt your heels towards the left, stretch the right side body. Inhale through center, exhale to the right, stretch left. Inhale center. Keep the heels lifted, start to ripple forward to a high plank. And then bend the knees as you send the hips back into your down dog. One more like that, rolling the spine, bringing movement into the back body. Beautiful, we meet in down dog, take a big breath in. And a big exhale. All right, roll forward to a high plank. Widen the feet hips width. Hands underneath the shoulders. The weight is just behind your right hand. We're gonna walk it up to a hover tabletop. In four, three, two, one. Start right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Push into your hands. Gaze a little bit forward, right, left. Your knees stay hovering the whole time. Right, left, right, left. You've got it. Keep going. Give me eight, seven, six, five. We're gonna hold it in that hover table. Grab the weight in the left hand. Three, two, one. Keep it forward, hover table. Weight in the left hand, slide it over towards the left. Left hand goes down, pick it up with the right. Slide it over towards the right. Left, slide, right, slide. Here's eight. So your knees are hovering the whole time. You're using the core to stabilize you as you pick the weight up. Here's four. We're gonna leave the weight on the left in three, two, one. Weight stays on the left, shoulder taps. Right hand, put it down. Left hand, put it down. So you're tapping opposite shoulder. Left, right, breathe. Left, right, left, right, right, left. Give me eight. Breathe. Six. Here's four, we're gonna walk it back to a plank. In three, two, one, both hands down. It's left foot, right foot, left foot, right foot. Back, back, forward, forward, you've got it. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Here's eight. Here's six. Keep breathing. Give me four, three. We'll hold it in our hover table. In two, one, hold it here. Weight in the right hand, slide it over. Put it back down, weight in the left hand, slide. Right and left. Keep breathing, right and left. My thighs are feeling it and my shoulders. Left, right, knees are still hovering. Here's four, three. We're gonna leave the weight on this side. Twist the hips. Right here, both hands down, twist. Center, left, center. So you're dipping your hips to one side. Right, left, right, 
left. So good. Here's eight, seven, six. We'll finish with shoulder taps in four, three, two, and one. Hold center. It's right, put it down, left, put it down, right, and left. So close. Final four, three, last two, and one. Both hands down, straighten the legs, walk the feet back down, dog. Ooh, feeling that in my thighs. Take a big breath in and a big exhale. Ha. Maybe pedal the feet a few times here. Taking deep breaths every time you're in down dog. Knowing that this is your rest pose. If you ever need child's pose, option to take it. Come to a still place. Inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, step or float top of the mat. Halfway lift, breathe in. Fold forward, breathe out. Inhale, sweep all the way up. Left hand, right wrist, breathe in. Bend over towards the left, stretch the right side body. Inhale, center, switch, right hand, left wrist. Exhale to the right. Inhale, center, exhale, bend the elbows, cactus the arms, squeeze. Inhale, arms high. Exhale, fold. Halfway lift. Step back, high plank. First chaturanga, halfway down. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. Inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, step or float, top of the mat. Halfway lift, inhale. Exhale, deep fold. Chair pose, sit low, sweep the arms to the sky, breathe in. Fold forward, breathe out. Halfway lift, inhale. Exhale, step back, high plank. Chaturanga, up dog, down dog. Lift your right leg to the sky. Bend your right knee, stack your hip, open right side body. Inhale, straighten the right leg with open hips. Exhale, square the hips down towards the mat. Step your right foot forward. Inhale, all the way up, crescent lunge. Exhale, opens you out, warrior two. Inhale, reverse, stretch, right side body, right knee stays bent. Exhale, cartwheel down, frame your foot, high to low plank. Up dog on your inhale, down dog on your exhale. Lift your left leg, breathe in. Bend your knee, stack your hip, open. Straighten the left leg with the hips open. Now square the hips off to the mat. Step, left foot forward. Crescent pose, breathe in. Warrior two as you breathe out. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, cartwheel down, frame your foot, high to low plank. Up dog, down dog. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. Inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, step or float, top of the mat. Halfway lift, fold. Bend the knees a lot here. Slide your hands to your low back. Interlace your fingers. Inhale, halfway lift. Push the fingers behind you. And then exhale, fold, chest expansion. Drop the head. Working into the shoulders, the front of the chest, the back. Head is reaching down towards the floor. You can straighten your legs a little or a lot here. Take a big breath in and out. Release the hands slowly all the way down to your low back and then to the floor. Find a halfway lift, breathe and lengthen. And a deep fold forward. Beautiful, inhale, roll up to stand. 
All right, we're gonna start body weight for the first sequence. <laughs> Make sure you don't have any weights on your mat. It's okay if that one is off to the side. Your right knee is gonna pull into your chest to start. We're gonna step the right knee down onto the floor. Keep the fingers tented, then kick the left foot back behind us. We'll step the left foot back up. Come all the way up, right knee into the chest. We'll move slow together in four, three, two, one. Right knee, left, kicks back, left, step, lift, up. It's back, knee down, kick, left foot, left foot, lift, knee into the chest, back, kick, forward, and lift, back, kick, forward, and lift. Keep going. So th something that we don't wanna do is crash down on our right knee. So if you need a soft surface, you can put one underneath. Up, lift, back, knee down, kick. Left foot steps and lift. Here's eight, seven, keep breathing. Six, we're gonna add a jump at the top. Not yet, in four, three, two, and one right here. Jump at the top, right knee down, kick, forward, jump. 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 Give me eight. Keep breathing, six. I like to stay on tented fingers here. Four, we're gonna keep it back in a one leg table. Start with booty. In two, one, right knee down, hands flat. Little lift in the left leg, up, up. My left leg is already burning. Lift, lift. Flex your left toes, soften your face. Soften in the elbows. Here's eight, seven, breathe, six, five. Give me four, we're gonna find a hamstring curl. Three, in two, in one, leg stays lifted. Curl, extend, curl, extend. Fire up through your core here. Keep gazing a little bit forward. You're curling your left heel in towards your booty. It's in and out. Give me eight, seven, like you're squeezing your hamstring. In, out, here's four. We're gonna keep the heel in, lower and lift the knee. In three, two, one, right here. Knee down, knee up. Knee down, knee up. Tap, lift, tap. Lift, really push your left heel up. Lift, lift, make sure you're not compromising your belly here. Lift, tap, lift, tap. So what I mean by that is hammocking the belly down to get the knee higher. Just go to, up to a height that feels good for you in your body. Lift, tap. Lift, tap, we're almost there. Lift, tap, up, down. Here's four, we're gonna point the toes. Little lifts. In three, two, one. Point the toes, little lifts. Up, up, push, push. Lift, lift, I am shaking. Can you lift from your hamstring? Lift, lift, you've got it. So good, lift, lift. Here's eight, seven, six, five. We're gonna take the knees together, then fire hydrant the left knee open. In three, two, one, knees together. It's open and close, open, close, out, in. Really squeeze your left glute. Working glute medius, 
It's on the outside of the hip. Out, in, out, in. Final push, eight, seven, six, five. We'll find an isometric hold in four, in three, in two, in one. Isometric hold for four, three, two, and one. Left knee down, tuck the toes under, send the hips high. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. Beautiful, inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, step or float, top of the mat. Halfway lift, fold. Inhale, roll all the way up, super slow. Beautiful, nice shoulder roll at the top. Ready to do that again. This time right foot stays planted, left knee comes into the chest to start. We're gonna go back nice and slow, left knee down. Kick right toes back, pull right foot in, lift up. It's back, kick, forward, lift, back, kick, forward, lift. Keep going, back, kick, forward, lift. You've got it. Here's eight, seven. I like to stay on tented fingers so that I have more lift in my chest it's just to step my right foot forward. Here's four. We're gonna add that little jump at the top. In three, in two, in one, right here. Left knee up, little jump, back, kick, step, 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 keep going, eight, kick, step, seven, kick, step, Here's six, kick, step, five, and we stay back, up. Here's three, keep going. Last two, make them really good. Last one, back, forward, up, back. Keep it in that one-legged table, just pulse. Up, up, lift, lift. My right leg is burning. Push, push, lift, lift. Hands are flat, core is engaged. Here's eight, seven, right foot is flexed. Six, five, here's four. We'll find that hamstring curl. In three, in two, in one, keep it lifted, curl. Stretch, curl, stretch, curl, curl. Beautiful, out, in. Your foot is still flexed. You're curling your heel in towards your booty. In, out, out, in. Here's four, three, we'll keep the heel in, lower and lift the knee. In two, one, heel stays in. Tap, kick, tap, kick, that is so hard. Lift, tap, flex your toes, squeeze your right glute, push, push. Can you embrace the burn? Here's eight. Here's seven. Here's six. Five, four, we're gonna point the toes, little lifts, in three, in two, in one, keep it lifted, point the toes, tiny lift, push, push, lift, lift so good, push, push, your core is still engaged, 
You're gazing forward. Push, push, lift, lift. Push, push. Give me eight, seven, six, and we'll find those fire hydrants. In four, three, here's two, and one, knees together. It's open, close, open, close. Holy right glute, it is burning. It's out, in, out, in, out, in, wide, center, final four. Three, then we're gonna isometric hold. In two, in one, hold it wide, just hold for four. Get a little higher for three. Final two. And one, knees together. This time, toes together, knees wide. Brief child's pose, stretch. Arms forward, hips back. Take a big breath in. And a big exhale. Huh. Beautiful, inhale, roll up to a seat. Grab your heavy weights as you come up to stand. We're gonna face the long edge of the mat. Take the feet wider than hips width. Toes stay parallel to the top and bottom of the mat. Palms forward, elbows bent in by the sides a bit. We're gonna bend the right knee as we bicep curl and then straighten the arm, straighten the leg. Let's go to tempo, down for two. Up for two, bend, extend, down, and up. Squeeze your biceps, bend, extend, keep going, bend, extend. You're sitting your booty back, bend, extend, maybe smile, bend, extend, so good, bend, extend. Here's eight. And six. Here's four, then we'll speed up the pace. In three, two, one. Right here, bend, extend, bend, extend. Squeeze your biceps as you bend your right knee. You're leaning a little bit forward. Your left leg stays straight. Bend, bend. Here's eight. Seven, six, five, we'll hold low. Four, three, two, one, hold low, arms 90, little pulse. Pulse in the arms, lift, lift, push, push. Tiny, curl, curl. Four, we're gonna add a little dip in the hips. Full curl in three, Two, one, dip curl, lift, dip curl, lift, dip curl, lift. Push into your right heel, up, down, lift, lower. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, then we switch sides. Three, two, and one, stand up. Weights in front of you. Left foot bends this time. We'll go down for two, up for two. Bend, extend, bend, extend. Keep breathing, bend, extend, bend, extend. Squeeze your biceps, bend, extend, bend. Extend, you've got it. Here's eight. Here's six. We're gonna speed that up. In four. In three. Two. One. Bend, extend. Up, down. Sitting your booty back. My biceps are burning. Elbows stay by the sides, but not in the rib cage. Here's eight. Six. Here's four. 
We're gonna hold it low, little pulse. In three, two, one, hold it low, little lift, lift, push, push. So your left knee is bent, you're finding a little pulse. Here's four. We'll add that curl as we dip. Three, two, one, right here. Curl, dip, little lift. Curl, lift, up, down. Squeeze your left glute. Squeeze your biceps. Your right leg is straight. Curl, lift, final eight. Final six. Final four, three, we're gonna skate side to side. In two, in one, hands to heart. It's right, left, right, left. Little burnout at the end. Right, left, stay low. Right, left, right, left. Final four, three, two, one. Stand, beautiful work. All right, grab your lighter set of weights. The heavies can go off to the top. Let's do some shoulders. My favorite and the hardest for me. All right, heels in, toes out this time. We're gonna bend the knees and then take the arms wide. Keep the elbows bent. Turn the palms to face forward so that your thumbs are lifting up to the sky. We're just gonna connect the weights in front of us and then open them back out wide. So it's forward and wide. Elbow stay soft. Forward and wide. Can you squeeze the tips of your shoulder blades together when you take the weights back? Wide, forward, wide, forward. Here's eight. Here's six, I'm already shaking. Here's four, we're gonna keep the weights in front of us. Bend the elbows. Three, two, one. Weights in front, bend the elbows. Little push, push. Let's add a dip in the hips as we push right here. So it's dip, push, dip, push, push, push. Weights are going up as your hips are going down. Here's eight, seven, Six, keep breathing. Five, we'll hold low, open the arms. In three, in two, in one, hold low. It's open, close, open, close. So this work, especially the ones that we resist most, are the best for us to do. Forward, wide, forward, wide. Can you sit a little bit lower? Forward, wide, out, in. Here's four, three. We're gonna draw the elbows by the sides. In two, one, elbows wide, pull in, take it up. In, up, in, up. It's like you're driving your elbows down towards your hips. In, up, in, up. We're so close. Here's eight, seven, six. We're gonna move to jumps. In four, we'll jump the weights together as we jump the feet together. In three, two, one, weights wide. It's in, jump out, in, jump out. Little cardio burst. It's in and out, in, wide. Keep breathing. Maybe smile because this is so fun. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Final four, we keep it wide. Three, two, and one. Keep it wide, shoulder press up, down, push, push, push. Final eight. Seven, six, five, last four, three, two, one. Weights down. Beautiful. All right, turn towards the top of your mat. Put your light weights up there. Grab your block. 
have it to your side. Once you come down, grab one heavy weight. All right, we're going to lay back the block. We're not using it just yet. Our right arm will be out towards the right. Our left leg is going to be long. Right knee will be bent. Left arm by the side. We're going to find a half Turkish get up. I'm feeling it from that cardio. I hope you are too. All right, I'll walk you through it. So we're going to go push up from the right shoulder. Keep it lifted. R left elbow, left hand. Tap weight to left toes. Lower, elbow, shoulder, elbow, push, elbow, hand, tap, lift, elbow, shoulder, elbow, push, elbow, hand, tap, lift, elbow, shoulder, elbow, keep going, push, lift, tap, up, down, down, down. So these super functional movements are so good for deep stabilizer muscles. They help us in daily life. Lift, lift, tap. Elbow, shoulder, elbow. Keep going. Little bit of core in here, of course, as well. Elbow, shoulder, elbow. My right shoulder is super feeling it right now. Down, down. Bend, extend, lift, lift, tap, down, down, shoulder, elbow. All right, let's keep it up this time. On the left hand, just tap. So it's a tap, extend, tap, extend, tap, extend, tap, extend. Here's four, then we switch sides. Three, here's two, and one, left hand down. Weight over to the right, right leg long. Lay all the way back. Left knee bends this time. Flex your right toes. Left elbow goes wide, right arm by your side. Let's push up from the left hand. So it's lift, elbow, hand, tap. Lower, elbow, shoulder, elbow. Push, elbow, hand, tap. Lower, elbow, Shoulder, elbow, push, elbow, hand, tap, lower, elbow, shoulder, elbow, keep going. Engage your core the whole time, lower, elbow, shoulder, elbow, breathe, lift, tap, lower, elbow, shoulder, elbow. Let's do four more. Lift, tap. Lower, elbow, shoulder, elbow. Here's three. Lift, tap, lower, elbow, shoulder, elbow. Here's two. Lift, hand, tap, lower, elbow, shoulder, elbow. Last one. Lift, tap, keep this tap. Up, down, lift. So you're lifting the left arm over your shoulder when you extend the leg away. When you're tapping, you're pulling left hand to right foot. Final four. Three. We're going to hold the weight overhead in a boat pose. Into one. Weight in either hand. Knees into the chest. Hold the weight overhead. Keep the knees bent. You're here or you're straightening. We're holding, ISO hold for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Cross the ankles, weight to chest. Whew, amazing. Nice work, grab your block. We're gonna lay onto our left side. The block is gonna be in front of us. We'll work inner thighs. So lay into the left hand. Right knee is gonna lean over onto the block. Left leg is going to be long. Flex your left toes. Take the weight to the inside of the left thigh. Flex your toes a lot here. Send your heel away from you. We're going to lift and lower. So it's a lift, lower, lift. Up, down, up. Breathe. A little bit of active recovery here. Lift, lower, lift. 
up, up. So when you lift, can you get your whole left thigh off the floor? All the way up to your hip bone. Lift, lower, lift. Here's eight, seven, six, five. We'll hold it up. Little lifts in four, three, two, one. Hold it up. Little lift and lift. Now push down into your right knee a little bit. Lift. See if that can help the lift. Lift, lift, up, up. My inner thighs are always sore after this one. Lift, lift, push, push. Here's eight. So as yogis, we really want tighter inner thighs. We're always stretching them. And they're super important for stabilizing our knee joints. Lift. Here's four. We're going to push left heel back. In three, keep the leg lifted. Right here, it's push, push, push. Back, back, back. This is the movement that always gets me. Push, push, push. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Then we switch sides. Four, three, two, and one. Left leg down, weight in front. Push yourself up. Sweep your feet around. Lay all the way onto your right side. Capture your head in your right hand. Left knee to the block, weight in the left hand, left hand to the inner thigh of the right leg, flex the right toes, lift and lower, four, three, two, one, it's lift, lower, lift. So again, you're pushing gently down into the left knee, creating a little bit of tension with that block. You're flexing your right foot, sending your heel away from you, lift, lower, lift. Keep breathing, up, down. Here's eight, seven, six, five. You've got it. Give me four, then we'll keep it lifted. Find a pulse. In three, two, one, keep it lifted, tiny lifts right here. Push, push, push. Try to get your whole right leg off the ground, you've got it. Push, push, push. Nice work, lift. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Give me four, three, two, one. Keep it lifted, little push back, back. It's back, back, back. Push, push, push. Back, back, back. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lower, weight to the side. Lay all the way on your back. Beautiful work. Step your feet down onto the floor. Grab. Your one heavy weight, if you want both of them, you can totally get them. We're gonna take it onto our low belly, hold it there so that it still feels comfortable. Heels down, feet hips width, tuck the tail, engage the core, lifting up to bridge. So it's lift, lower, push, tap. So you wanna push more down into your heels than to your back. So we're lifting from our legs. It's lift, lower, up, down. Give me eight, six. Here's four, three, two, one. Keep it lifted, tiny lifts. Push, push. So you're squeezing your glutes. Lift, lift. Here's eight, seven, six. Five, we're gonna keep the hips up, lift the heels. In four, three, two, one, keep it lifted, heels up right here. It's lift, lower, lift, 
lower, heels up, heels down, heels up, heels down. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Can you do this from your hamstrings? Four, three. We're going to keep the heels up, little lifts. In two, in one, right here, a little lift, lift. So you're pushing your hips up towards the sky. Squeeze your glutes. Give me eight, six, here's four, three. We're gonna keep that pulse, jog the heels right here. So it's right and left, right and left. Jog right, left, right, left, right, left. So you're pushing your hips up. When you lift the heel, the hips drop for that brief moment that you have both heels down. Eight, seven, six. Faces soft. Here's four. Right heel is gonna stay up. Little pulse. In three, two, one. Right heel up. Just push, push, lift, lift, keep breathing, push, push, lift, lift. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Give me four, three, two. We're gonna jog the heels, one, right here. So it's left, right, left, right. We're so close, left, right, left, Right, here's eight, six, left heel stays up. In four, three, two, one, left heel up, little push, lift, lift, really squeeze your glutes. You've got it, lift, lift. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, both heels down, both heels up. Heels down, heels up. Hips are still lifted. Up, down, lift, lower. Final eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Heels up, just hold, iso hold. Four, three, two, one. Heels down, hips down. Weight down to the side. Beautiful work. Knees into the chest. One little release for the glutes. All right, we're gonna take the block in between our knees. I like it on the skinniest setting so that my knees are still over my hips for the most part. Squeeze that block. Toes super light on the floor, heels lifted. Hands behind the back of the head. We're gonna do a circular crunch. So tuck the tail under, engage the core. We'll lift over towards the right, center, left, lay down. Right, center, left, lay down. Right, center, left, lay down. Keep going. So as always, we wanna lift from our shoulders rather than our neck, down. Right, left, or center, left, down. Right, center, left, down, getting 360 degrees of your core. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Can you keep your elbows wide? Four, right, center, left, down, right, center, left, down. Here's two, center, left, down, one, center, left, down. Just crunch, regular crunches. Up, down, all right, let's add the knees into the chest with a squeeze on the block. Not yet. In four, three, two, one, right here. Lift, squeeze, lower, lift, squeeze, lower. So you're just pulling the knees towards the chest. Little hip lift as you squeeze the block. So many things going on. Lift, lower, here's eight. Breathe. Here's six. Here's four, we'll keep it lifted. Tiny pulse. In three, 
two, one, keep it lifted, tiny pulse, up, up, both your hips and your shoulders are lifting, pulse, pulse, lift, lift, push, push, my abs are burning, lift, lift, keep squeezing that block, lift, lift, up, up, lift, lift, up, up. Here's four, we're gonna put the feet down, circular crunch to the left, in three, two, one, toes down, it's left, center, right, down, left, center, right, down, it's left, center, right, down, keep going, left, center, right, down, heels are lifted, toes are light, down, left, center, right, down, here's four, center, right, down, here's three, center, right, down, here's two, center, right, down, last one, center, right, down, just crunch, lift, lower, crunch, tap, up, down, squeeze that block, here's four, three, knees into the chest, in two, in one, right here, it's crunch, tap, crunch, tap, final eight, six, four, three, we're gonna hold it in a tiny ball, in two, in one, hold it in a tiny ball, reach the hands forward, try to touch your toes, hold, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, lower all the way down, move that block off to the side, full body stretch. Reach the legs long, let the toes fall out towards the sides, and then reach the arms above the head. Take a big clearing breath in, and an expansive sigh out. <sighs> Beautiful, one more like that, breathe in. And breathe out. When you're ready, circle your arms around to collect your knees into your chest. Give yourself a little squeeze around your forehead up. And then stepping the feet down on the floor, windshield wiper the legs side to side a few times. Massaging through the glutes. Love to do this after I work out. Feels so good on the low back, the lumbar spine. When you're ready, moving through center, we'll find a quick figure four, cross right leg over. Draw your knees into your chest, interlace fingers. Keep your right toes flexed. And try to relax into this stretch. So not pushing yourself to a place that is too far or not sustainable for your body. Keeping your right knee safe and making sure you always feel good in the stretch. That way you can maximize the stretch in the body. When you're ready, slowly release the fingers. Step the left foot down. Right leg straight up, little hamstring stretch. Hold behind the back of the right leg anywhere besides the knee joint. Shoulders are heavy and soft on the mat. Face is soft, eyes are relaxed. You can straighten the left leg long, a little opening through the front of the left leg. Gently guiding your right knee in towards your chest. And then from here, right knee into the chest, twist, right knee over towards the left, open the right arm out. That feels so good. Your right shoulder is planted. Your gaze is following your right fingers. Long, slow, deep breaths here. When you're ready, move through center. Step both feet down. Just a few times, windshield wiper side to side. And then moving through center, cross left leg over, figure four. Knees come into the chest if that is where you want to go with this stretch. Interlacing your fingers, 
drawing your knees in towards your belly. Trying to soften as much as possible into this. Our body actually sends out signals into the muscles that it's okay to stretch when we are more relaxed. So can you find a feeling of relaxation right here? When you're ready, slowly plant your right foot down. Lift your left leg straight up. Little hamstring stretch. Reaching your left heel towards the sky. Right foot can stay bent or you straighten it long. Little extra stretch in the front of the right leg. And then gently drawing left knee into the chest. Twisting left knee over towards the right, opening the left arm. Gaze towards your left hand. On your inhales, lengthening. And your exhales, twisting a little bit deeper. Next inhale, draw through center. Squeeze both knees into the chest. And then laying the head back down, one final pose, happy baby. Heels to the sky, knees as wide as feels good. Holding either the outside edges of the feet, the shins, the thighs. Maybe finding a little rock side to side. Feels so good after that inner thigh work. This pose is also about stabilizing the spine. So think about drawing your tailbone towards the mat, tucking your chin slightly in towards your chest to find length from your cervical spine, your neck, all the way down to your lumbar spine, your low back. When you're ready, slowly knees into the chest one final time. You can round your forehead up. Give yourself a big squeeze. And then lowering down either into Supta Baddha Konasana or full Shavasana. Toes wide, legs stretched long, arms by the sides. Find a moment here to settle. Noticing the quality of your breath, the quality of your thoughts. Can you let your breath flow naturally? And each pressing thought that pops up, can you let it be there? And then let it go without any attachment to it. Let's clear a final breath together. We'll hold it in at the top. So on your next exhale, take a big sigh out of the mouth. And then inhale a big breath of fresh air into the lungs. Holding it in at the top. Sip in a little bit more and a little bit more. Let your belly puff up with air. We're always pulling it down, holding it in. So let it expand and notice what that feels like. Holding for three, for two, and one together, let it go. <sighs> Make a sound, push all of that breath out. And then allow the natural rhythm of your breath to come back in. Staying here at 
for as long as feels good. When you're ready to come out, move slowly, breathe deeply, coming back into your body. Rolling to one side to press yourself up into a comfortable seat. Meeting me in a seat, eyes closed back down. Take your hands into your heart center. One final check in, notice how you feel. Is there anything that you can leave here on your mat right now? And is there anything that came up during practice that you wanna take with you into the rest of your day? Take a big expansive inhale. And a clearing sigh out, let it go. Hands come up to the forehead center. Together we say namaste. Beautiful work. Thank you so much for being here with me. Like I said at the beginning of the video, follow me on Instagram so that we can connect more. If you don't already, I often do polls and all of that there. And I hope you love this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye.